Drop a like for a little extra nuclear luck in Cold War. Today we're going to be taking a look at a weapon that we have yet to break down in detail and we'll be giving you the best loadout to use for this monstrous weapon. The unique aspect of this class setup has to do with the magazine. In fact, the name Bullfrog really suits it well as you'll be bulldozing through enemies, hardly ever having to reload or at least less frequently than other weapons. Truly a perfect weapon for nuclear streaks as there is less chance you'll get caught in that awkward reload animation and that. We will show you how to maximize damage and reduce reloading with the best magazine in the game. Carnage AK in this video drops a very fast and incredibly clutch nuclear as he gets the last kill of the game for the 30th kill right as he gets killed. 100% make sure to watch to the end of this video guys, it's well worth it. Make sure to try this loadout, share it around with your friends, let us know what you think of it in the comments below as well as what weapon you want us to cover next and we'll feature your comments in the next class setup video. Lastly, don't be a part of this 77% that watches our content regularly, but just simply forgot to subscribe to join the carnage. Hit that red button ASAP. It only takes 0.03 seconds and it's entirely free. Use code CARNAGE at checkout for 10 to 30% off all G Fuel purchases at gfuel.com. And with that all being said, let's hop right in to this bullfrog best class setup. Alright, what is going on everybody? It is your boy Carnage your Primitive AK here, back with another video for you guys today. Today we are here with the Bullfrog class setup. Uh, there's two variations of this class that I use, we're going to be focusing on just one of them today. So if you guys are new to the Carnage channel and, are, and or have never watched any of our videos before, uh, make sure you guys hit that sub button, turn on those post notifications so you guys never miss a team challenge, class setup, tips and tricks, or anything Call of Duty related on the channel. But today, we're going to be focusing on the Bullfrog and my ideal class setup that I like to use in pubs. Uh, so for, for those that are new, um, the Bullfrog, pretty underrated SMG in my opinion. It's got really nice bullet velocity as well as decent damage and fire rate. Uh, I believe this one's actually better than the MP5 in my personal opinion. So the attachments we're going to be rocking in this case is going to be the KGB Eliminator. I prefer this one over the Suppressor because you're not losing that 25% range, which is quite significant for this weapon. And due to its low damage, you don't really want to nuke the range any further on this weapon. So KGB Eliminator is going to be the way to go for this one. Your next attachment is going to be the 7.4 Task Force. This one's kind of a no-brainer. Um, this one gives you that extra 3% damage, which may not sound like much, but that's going to help you out in close range fights a lot. And on top of that, you're getting that 50% extra range and 75% bullet velocity at the cost of quite a bit of some recoil management issues. But if you notice the recoil is a bit much, the next best option is actually the Liberator, which is going to give you that 100% bullet velocity, which is actually very, very helpful on this weapon. Turns it into a hit scan, basically. Next attack we're going to be rocking is the VDV Speed Grip. Speed grip. The reason why we're not using the Spetsnaz for the extra recoil control is because you're losing that 30% movement speed, which is quite critical on this weapon. And in this case, I just want to maintain that movement speed, so uh, having the Speed Grip is going to give you the best of both worlds in this case. Next up is going to be the 85 round fast mag. This one's kind of a no-brainer as well. That 25% ADS speed really doesn't mean too much on this weapon, so you're going to want to have as many bullets as possible, so that way you don't have to reload as much. And last but not least, the last attachment is going to be the Groot Elastic. This is a standard attachment I use on all of my weapons. You really can't get anything better than 30% ADS speed, flinch resistance, and also your able to drop shot as well. So you're getting three amazing extra perks on this weapon but without further ado we're gonna go ahead and jump into the gameplay got a nice gameplay lined up for you guys today actually clutched up towards the end so if you guys are new make sure you guys leave a like hopefully you guys enjoy the gameplay let's get right into it all right ladies and gentlemen we're here now with the Domination. bullfrog here in a nice little pub match gonna see what we can dig up here we're gonna try to rotate through mid map got you Not bad at all. Nice little three piece to kick things off. Got you. Hopefully, I don't get caught inside here. Oh, that guy scared the heck out of me. What the heck? Got him. I'm gonna chill here for a second. Let my teammate get that cap. Nice little seven streak right now. Let's try to keep it up. That was a little weird. There's a guy up here. Wait, nope. He was next to me. That guy's a warrior. Oh. 
And you're still sitting down there with an AK-74U, bro. Man probably watched our Carnage video showcasing the class setup for that. Or at least I hope he did. Did he use code Carnage at G Fuel as well? It doesn't seem like they want to move at all. Got you. And you just don't want to die, apparently. This thing does have a bit of some kick. I will say that much. Oh, he's assassinating. That's why. That's why he's doing that. Get the fuck out of here with that, dude. Actually annoying the heck out of me playing like that. I'm gonna go around these guys. There's two guys back there. Teammate, what the heck are you doing, bro? Tally, Sam threat. Come on. There you go. That wasn't so hard, was it? Come on out. No more hiding. Here we go. 47 and 10 first half. Let's go ahead and pick it up second half. I'm going to see what I can do this round. Dude, why are you playing like that? Move around, man. There's a guy back there. You need to stop, dude. Jammer's up. Guy's really free firing. Look at him. Brat. Guy's up top. Yeah, I see it, buddy. Woo wee! Got VSAT, so we're good. We're chilling. We're big chilling. Let's keep this energy going. I'm gonna wait for these guys. Ah, uh, that's what I get for not paying attention. There's no way I'm witnessing teammates walk right past this guy. Got him. And you're not dead. And that's a nice little quad feed there. I'll take that. Don't mind if I do. Gonna push straight mid map. One guy hiding in a corner back here still. I don't know why he likes sitting back there so much. Out of him. So no one's gonna shoot this guy. Okay. You're gonna go around. Got him. You need to stop. You need to stop. You need to stop. That's cheeky. I was about to say, teammates, you guys need it together. Wait, they didn't kill him? I was about to say, bro. The heck? I don't know where these guys are at. Got him. There's a 15. See if we can keep this going. Didn't even see that guy. Oh boy. We're going to show for a minute. That's a nice 20. 
I will take that. Don't mind if I do. There are still guys in this area, so I'm going to have to be careful about this push. How do you know to look there? Yeah, I saw you, buddy. Don't try it. Got 22. That could have been ugly. Still alive, so that's a plus. I don't know where he came from. Kind of had to bait my teammate there. I don't like doing that, but... Oh, I saw you, buddy. There's definitely still more back here. 27. 28. Oh, got the nuke at the last second. Let's go. Clutched up and got the nuke at the last second, boys. GG's. Whoo. I just had to full rush that, man. That was a little bit clutch there. We got the nuke, though. That's all that matters, man. GG's. Drop a like for this bullfrog class and drop a like for that clutch nuke at the end there. GG's, boys. That's what I'm talking about. I didn't think we were going to get that. <laughs> but I'll take it. GG's.